For 18 years, I have dreamed of having that magical interaction with manta rays. It consumed my every thought. Over the years, I have eagerly planned dive trips to manta-rich waters, only to have disappointment. Komodo's Manta Alley was taken off of the itinerary because of high winds in the area. The German Channel in Palau, three dives, no mantas. Pneumonia struck two weeks before leaving for the Maldives, which meant canceling the trip. I thought for sure the famous Kona Manta night dive would deliver, only to try three different nights with no mantas. Disappointed, but still hopeful, I had to try one last time. The first four days of my trip to Socorro were hampered with strong winds keeping me from the best sights. But then, on the fifth day, something happened. Watching the manta rays glide in the sun rays was magical. I loved seeing the way that they had no fear around the divers, sometimes even stopping to wait for interactions. The mantas were so aware of their surroundings, gracefully maneuvering in between divers, pausing, ensuring everyone had their own personal interaction. The best dive day of my life was worth waiting for. For that same experience, I would gladly wait another 18 years. <laughs> 